Hello and welcome to the ITV News Traineeship. I'm Natasha Carter and I present the Good Morning Britain bulletins for Granada Reports. Seven years ago, I was in the exact same position as you. I started off as a trainee at ITV Central and it gave me the chance to produce, report and present the news. It's such an amazing opportunity to develop your skills as a broadcast journalist, but don't just take my word for it. Hello, my name's Amit. I was the trainee in Wales. <laughs> One of the best things that happened on the traineeship was in the last week, one of the Granada news team came in and asked if anyone was around to interview Simon Cow. So I immediately put my hand up. Like a bridge over I know a lot of people right now are not in great places for all manner of things, but this one hit home. When you listen to the lyric and when you see the video, you're reminded of what happened. Um, and it could happen to anyone, to anyone, to anyone. It was pretty cool. My top tip would just be to embrace every single challenge um, because you will get a lot thrown at you and you think, oh my God, this is too much, this is too much, especially on your last week where you have to put together two programmes um, in Granada. <laughs> Hi, my name's Jonathan Brown and I'm the former ITV trainee here at Calendar in Leeds. The last nine months for me have been fantastic. I've really enjoyed every minute and it's been great to really learn the ins and outs of broadcast journalism from people who really know what they're talking about. Getting to see a story right the way through from the planning stage, through camera work, through editing and scripting and then voicing it and seeing it go out on air is an experience I never expected to really have. It's a matter of making the most of the fact that that training is there available to you and that you've got the opportunity to really experiment and learn and grow as a journalist. And the only other thing I'd say would be just to try and make yourself useful within the newsroom, come up with ideas, come up with things that could be useful to your fellow journalists. The only other thing I'd say is just good luck, enjoy the experience and if all else fails, come to us. We're always here to help. We'll be in your newsrooms. Give us a shout. Any headphones? There are. Headphones. That looks more authentic. Hi, I'm Catherine. I was the ITV channel trainee and I now work here at ITV Yorkshire. The training scheme really is the best nine months. There's no better feeling than producing your first solo late bulletin or getting your first package on air. Three, two, one, on air. Good morning, these are the GMB headlines from Calendar. My advice to all of you would be, don't be afraid to make mistakes. You've got some of the best teachers in the industry and now is the time to really practice and hone your craft. And most of all, have fun. Hello, I'm Emily Reader with the Good Morning Britain headlines from Time Tees. I've been the trainee here at Time Tees and Border for the past uh, nearly a year now. And being from the North East, it's great to come back to my hometown and work in the newsroom for the television programme I've watched since I was little. This week, I am producing Good Morning Britain bulletins. Are you Four over. And my favourite week of training was when we went to Calendar in Yorkshire for a writing course. It was sort of the first time we as trainees were given that opportunity to, to take on the role of reporters and producers and pull together packages. That was a real test for us because the timescale of it was fairly realistic. Work's underway here at Manchester Victoria to repair the damage done in the blast, with the arena expected to reopen its doors for concerts in September. My advice to you as a former trainee is to enjoy every single moment. Take on board all the training, have a fantastic nine months. It is hands down the best thing I've ever done and I wish you all the very best of luck. Well, I enjoyed every second of the traineeship and I'm sure you will too. I think some of the highlights were doing that writing training up in Leeds and what I found there is you're learning things which you can put into practice the next week when you're back in your region writing ULAs for whatever bulletin you may be working on. And the highlight for me was definitely going to Good Morning Britain though, seeing how that massive national programme operates. Well, if I could give you two bits of advice, I'd say firstly, start a diary. Once a day, every couple of days, write down what you've been doing in your newsroom. It's going to be super useful when it comes to things like job interviews, but it's also very helpful when it comes to tracking your progress and development as a trainee. 
The second piece of advice I'd offer would just be to ask. Ask if you've got any questions, if you'd like to try something out. You've got mentors, line managers, Elaine is wonderful, and you can go to your head of news. They're more than happy to help you with any question you might have. I'm sure you'll have a great nine months, and I look forward to meeting you when you come to Bristol. I'm Teresa, and I'm based at Granada Reports. So at the moment, I'm producing bulletins with a view eventually to producing the programme. Biggest standout moment for me would be the night of the Manchester terror attack. The news was quickly spreading across the globe and it was up to us to get accurate accounts on the website as soon as possible. And because we weren't broadcasting on TV, we had to get camera operatives and reporters in place to do Facebook Lives. Our online content was being used across the globe. We ended up taking in all the media that night. We stayed till seven in the morning the next day, um, going home for a couple of hours, coming straight back again. Big breaking news stories is the reason that I'm doing this job. So my advice, enjoy every minute of it because it goes so quickly. Listen to your presenters. They're more experienced than you probably might think. They know how the news should sound. So enjoy every moment of it. Set yourself goals, be yourself and good luck.